The Motion Analysis Centre is, is very similar to what people might be familiar with already uh, from movies and video games. You know, the, the capture and the animation that goes on in a lot of movies and video games is done through, through motion analysis. All right, Lynn, now we're going to just take these little markers and we're going to put them on your feet. We put these reflective balls on specific parts of the leg and uh, the joints of the child. And we also use a little electrodes that record their muscle activity when they walk. In here, we would have eight infrared cameras around the perimeter of the room. And have them go through the motions of uh, hockey or soccer or baseball, or whatever, and that's captured. And then we would also get to see their muscle activity and we can take all that information then and analyze that at the end. Yeah, and so you can see the EMG looks good. Oh, that looks super yep. good there. Excellent. Landon, that's good. The lab is a, is a very available tool, even for patients that are not having surgical treatment, to analyze different abnormalities that people have with gait. So we can use it for patients that are requiring orthotics. We can use it for patients that have neurological problems, spinal cord problems. If this patient may need a certain type of splint, we use it for our patients after casting to see if it helps at all with their deformities and how that helps with their walking. And it can be a very effective research tool. It is kind of a special thing because it's the only clinical center in Eastern Canada that is doing this and from a, a clinical point of view. So it's really cool to do. When he was two years old, he was diagnosed with a right hemi cerebral palsy. So we've been followed up with the Janeway ever since. When I heard of gait analysis first, I had no idea. I had to actually go Google it. When they brought us in, they walked us in, they showed us around and they gave us a quick story of it and how painless it is because that was his issue. He thought it was gonna be needles or something. <laughs> he was worried about that. It's very high tech and and if you're into the movie CGI stuff, that's what the first thing I thought of when I saw it all. And he thinks it's pretty cool. I think there's a very big role for having the parents able to look at a video of their child and being able to look at this is what they look like pre and this is how they look post. Now we can actually, instead of saying, yeah, they look better, we actually have the hard data that, yeah, they're, we've made a change, we've made a difference. And when they can do their robot dance or do something like that, it's really, really interesting to see. <laughs> now you're dancing. <laughs>